But it's been exactly 20 days that this mulch fire has been burning, and that's 20 days that thousands of residents have been concerned about the air quality. So they addressed that at that presser that they just had here this evening with a health expert saying that the area that is burning has not been chemically treated, so there is no risk of chemical exposure from that smoke. Now, with attempts to put out the fire so far unsuccessful, the county reached out to the state Monday for their help with a new plan they're confident will work. The city reached out to the governor's office for a help to, with for help delivering millions of gallons of water to douse the pile with per day. That involved emergency permitting. The governor's office answering first thing Tuesday morning, giving the green light so they will have the reclaimed water they need for this new plan. The uh, reclaimed water that will be produced is actually going to be between five and six million gallons a day. Uh, to give you an idea of the scope of the, of the problem, it takes about a, a million and a half gallons to create one foot of water. So we anticipate this is going to take a few days for really to be effective for us. Um, a fire engine on a site couldn't provide anywhere near that amount of water. And the delivery of that water that they got the green light for should have it within the next 24 hours, they say, hopefully by tomorrow night. And that means the fire, fingers crossed, should be out within a few days. Now, as far as the cause of the fire goes, they're going to need to complete a full investigation. Live in Fort Pierce, Tara Jake, YWPBF 25 News.